Google Docs is useful online application for those who work in groups and need to constantly share their works with others. There is a lot you can do with Google Docs. The great thing is it stores your information online securely and it is free to use. In this video we will look at how to create a contact us form in Google Docs and have the fields validated by a free jQuery script. After you open an account, log in to Google Docs. You will see this page on the screen. Click on Create New tab and select Form from the drop down list. I already have a form created, so let me click on it. The corresponding spreadsheet opens where the data collected are stored. Clicking the Form tab and then Edit Form pops up this dialog box. Let me click this link at the bottom to come to the page that has my form. I will now right click anywhere on the page and select View Page Source. This is the HTML code for the page. Since I need only the code involving the form, I will select all that is there between the opening and closing form tags. Let me now paste this code in a plain text editor that renders this HTML page. I will add some styles to it and complete the form with all the necessary codes. The form finally looks like this. And we will look at the HTML source code to see how it is done. In the head section there are three short pieces of code. The first calls the jQuery library from Google API site. The second refers to the jQuery validation script I have taken from the morning copy website. The third piece of code simply puts the validation script into action. Continuing further, this is the code for the custom page redirect that is triggered after successful submission of the form. In my case, the redirect page is thankyou.html to thank those who use my form. The form action is the same Google spreadsheet URL we have used earlier. Note the form ID is the same as that ID that is triggered by the validation code above. I have broken up the page HTML into separate sections for each input so that it is easy to understand. The entire code is given in my blog article for reference. Feel free to use the code for your need. This is how my form looks like after I have embedded it in my blog with iframe tags. Lastly, you can set preference for the contact form in Google Docs. Open the spreadsheet, click share and just follow the steps shown. Hope this tutorial helps you. Thanks for watching.